Hi everyone, welcome to Sea Airspace 2022 just outside Washington DC. We are now on the IX Blue booth. He's the president of IX Blue Defense Systems, Ted Curley. Ted, good afternoon. Good afternoon. Thanks for welcoming us. So what are you demonstrating at the show this year? First, thanks Xavier, thanks to Naval News. We appreciate this opportunity. So we're demonstrating our Drix unmanned surface vehicle. What we're doing is we're live streaming the data from La Ciotat, France in the Mediterranean and running it from the booth. What is uh, Drix exactly? So Drix is an unmanned surface vehicle. It's, it's eight meters. It's capable of out, being outfitted with various different sensor suites. And so this week what we're doing is we have a multi-beam echo sounder and we're conducting surveys in the Mediterranean, mapping the bottom of the floor. How challenging is it to conduct such a demonstration across such great uh, distances? Uh, it's not a challenge at all. It's something that we've done before. We've done it at other trade shows and it's something that the Drix is certainly capable of doing. Ted, besides uh, the demo and uh, the Drake's USV, you're also showcasing uh, INS systems. Can you tell us more about the M11? Yeah, sure. So um, in addition to the unmanned surface vehicles, the company is really known for a couple other things, uh, navigation primarily, and then also photonics. Uh, the X-Blue is w known worldwide for its fiber optic gyros. And so the Marin's M11 is the highest grade fiber optic gyro on the market today. It's currently being tested by the Office of Naval Research Center. IX Blue is a French company. Can you tell us more about uh, the history of uh, IX Blue different systems here in the US? Sure, so we're coming up on our 20th year as a, having a footprint in the US. We were originally based in Massachusetts. We've recently moved to Lincoln, Rhode Island. Uh, so we are a manufacturer there. We're capable of, of manufacturing some of the inertial navigation systems. That was for a US Navy contract that we won for the LCS Freedom Class ships. Uh, we're also a provider of our compact inertial navigation systems for many of the unmanned underwater vehicles that are here at the show this week. We are also looking forward to um, manufacturing the Drix unmanned surface vehicle in the U.S. So that's what the future holds for IX Blue Defense Systems uh, in the near term? Uh, yeah, future's bright. We've got a lot of great things on the go and uh, a lot of new technology coming out. So we're very excited. All right, Ted. Thank you very much. Thank you.